Yeah, we on Boss Talk TV. Shout out to E. He the reason you see me. Yo, so it's the BET Awards. Um, today is about to be the biggest day. I'm super excited. It's summertime. I got a jacket on. Um, I thought that I could be able to get dressed by like 3.34 and be there, but for some reason I missed it and I got to be there at 1 o'clock. Um, and so here's here's where you're in this crazy position because it's like I want to be dressed. I want to have my suit on. But what I don't do, go right, go. Um, what I don't do is is play late business. So if BET said 1 o'clock and now it's about to be 1 o'clock, this is what I got to wear to the BT. Because being on time looks better than not being on time, but looking good. What are your thoughts on that? I mean, I don't want to wear this to the BT. It's hot outside. I got a jacket on, but I will not be late. One o'clock BT. I am arriving right now, 10 minutes early. I always try to be professional. Hopefully, you know. Maybe at some point I can get dressed in the bathroom later, but. Hey, man, check it, man. Boss Talk 101, man. We just uh, really, really, really checking in, man. Check it, check it, check it, man. It's going down, man. I couldn't believe it when I seen it that night when it happened. Well, you know, uh, Ray J, as y'all seen, you know, um, he was poised, ready to go. And Ray J, you know, it, you know, it, it, he going to bring it. If you bring it to him, he going to bring it to you. That's just how he roll, man. Um but he was poised. He didn't get to put his suit on. That's why y'all didn't see him in the suit at the BET Awards because he didn't want to be late. He went live early on to say, I don't want to be late. I was going to talk about this yesterday, and everybody, but it keeps trending to where people keep hitting me up saying, hey, man, what's up with Ray J? Well, here's what's up with Ray J from my perspective. Ray J just doing what Ray J do. Ray J been doing this. Ray J, this ain't nothing new for Ray J. Ray J is one of them ones, man. Like, he ain't going. Uh, when you see him, it's going to be some respect R and B or not. He not for to play with you. Uh, he going to stand on what he stand on. He going to be serious about it. So if he bringing it, he going to bring it with you. So, you know, the show went great. You know, I, some say he couldn't even get in or he got kicked out. It's a few th rumors out there, but this ain't nothing new for Ray J. Ray J like this temperature. This is the temperature that Ray J gets down in, you know, uh, there's been several stories where Ray J w went in, you know, you remember when Fabulous had to deal with Ray J, you know, he was hanging out with Mayweather and him, he felt like I could do what they doing, they got, don't make me get ugly, and then you've seen him a few times on videos, he's not going to bag down, so when you see him get into it with Zeus, uh, CEO, this is something that already had been stemming, I had seen it earlier on The Breakfast Club, and he was talking about it, so they was already having their back and forth. And I guess he just had ran up on him when he seen him, you know, and I mean, you know, you know what, what time it is when I see you, like Pac said, you better holler at me. Like, this is something that he wasn't trying to hear. And he said what he said. And all of a sudden you, you see the water Well, you see Ray tried to swing at the nigga. You know, Ray, Ray tried to jump to jump the crowd swing. And, uh, I'm, somebody from Zeus, uh, CEO camp threw some water. Or threw something, it got in somebody's eyes. It was some stuff that was thrown. We don't know what liquids these guys got out there. You don't know what's going on. This Hollywood stuff is different. And I'm tripping off of the way this whole thing transpired. So just 
you know, just thinking about it, Ray J is one of them guys, man, that, like I said, this ain't no new temperature for him. The Zeus CEO guy, is my, really hadn't seen him much until it came to this Zeus network, you know. But at the end of the day, you got to understand, man, everybody trying to keep their brands going. It's getting real serious out here, man. Uh, but one thing I wanted to home in on, if you look, when Ray J, on, they throw that water, he go to get that backpack. When he goes to get that backpack, it's time for y'all to get back. You know, you don't run up on a nigga that's getting a, get, a backpack. We don't know what was in it. It could have been uh, some mace. It could have been some that blicker. It could have been a bunch of things. But when you see somebody grab something, hey, listen, I've seen, you remember this? I know y'all remember this. When you see, I don't care who they is, how big they are, where you see them do it at, but when you see this motion, it's time to get some act right. When Ray J went around that car and he come back with that bag, I don't know what he, he meant business. When somebody go get a bag, pop trunk, say, hey, I'm going to go do it. I'm, when I get back, all these are signs y'all need to get out of there because I'm going for it all at this point. So let, 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 let's, let's look at this one right here. This guy right here. Here's another example. Going for it all, man. I know y'all remember this. Oh, oh. Or what? Or what? Nothing. Yeah, see, so when you see somebody, I don't care if how big they is, you see when King got the bag, once somebody get the bag, you got to get back. You don't know what's about to happen after that. Get back. When you see the bag come out, get back. Uh, Ray J went and got the bag. You see him go here, get the bag. That means you need to get back. He for the, he for the let that thing go. And if he let it go, whoever can get hit. You seen what happened with even with, with when when my when uh the Migo member. You remember him? Uh, was it takeoff? Uh, yeah. When when that happened with him, like once the stuff started going crazy, it, anything can happen at that point. So you know now I'm hearing Ray J is going through mental issues right now. So now it's been switched. He's having suicidal thoughts, all kind of stuff, man. So it's like, man, we all go through mental illnesses, man. So, you know, all I'm saying is when you see somebody going through it like this, man, it's happening right before your very eyes. When I was young, you didn't see it. You, you didn't see, you don't have to live and stand on what was on this internet. So that's the thing, man. I'm praying for all these youngsters out here. Ray J is a youngster to me. Uh, these are these, everybody that's going through it, that's displaying it on the internet in a negative way when your negative things happen, when your good things happen, man, kudos to you, because that's a lot of pressure, man. So, man, hey, listen, man, I had to just really, really think about, let me go on and say something about this, but if Ray J going through something, y'all keep Ray J in y'all prayers. Listen, man, get in these comments, man, let me know. Is Ray J suicidal right now, or is Ray J just being Ray J? What's going on with Ray J right now? Um, what 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 was in that bag? Comment Tim, what y'all think was in that bag? Y'all think what what y'all thought he had? Let me know. Um, listen, man. Hey, I know what be in the bag when we, when when they go grab that bag. Y'all better get back. Quit standing around when a nigga grab a bag, cause it can get real real bad when a nigga grab a bag. Listen, man. Boss Talk One On One, man. Make sure you like, subscribe to the channel. Make sure you holler at your boy ECO. Keep watching. It's been another great segment of Boss Talk Reviews. Uh. Yeah, we on Boss Talk TV. Shout out to E-Heat, a reason you see.